hello everyone welcome back to my channel not long ago i made two videos on the citron emulator for both pc and linux and many of you guys recommended that i should make a tutorial for android as well so in today's video i'll be showing you guys on how to download and install the citron emulator for android so please don't skip this video it is packed with useful information and without much ado let's get started Now before we dive in, let me explain what Citron is for those who are new here. Okay, Citron is a Nintendo Switch emulator designed specifically for homebrews games and which are fan-made games. And unlike the other emulators, Citron focuses solely on legal homebrew content, meaning it's all about playing games without breaking any copyright laws. So if you are a fan of playing Nintendo Switch games, this emulator could be your new best friend whether you are using Android, PC or Linux. Now let's dive into the installation process. Okay, so we are here for the installation of the emulator. And uh, what you have to do is you have to get the emulator. I mean, you have to download the Citron emulator. So um, to download the emulator, head over to this website, which says Citron citron emoorg head over to the site head over to this site citron emoorg head over to the site and then on the website you should see something like citron nintendo home view emulator and then home features and so on just scroll down to this section over here which says download citron just scroll down to this session so here just press on download like this and then it should take you to the agit web page so on the agit web page you see see something like citron android and then citron linux See something like Citron Android, Citron Linux, and then Citron Windows. For the um, we are installing this emulator on Android, so probably we will go for the Citron Android, which is this one. So you will need to download the Android version, which is this one. So download it, and I've already download the Android version, which is this one over here so now um you you now have the citron emulator and what's left is you have to get your firmware and the product keys with that one i can't show you where to get them because of nintendo policy on youtube so with that one you have to do a little research on your own so um after getting the emulator just click on it and install the emulator Now, after it is being finished installed, just open it. Press understand. And then here, you, sh you should see the home page like this. Now, just press on this certain icon over here. Just press on here. And then we are going to set it up. I mean, we are going to set the emul emulator up. First of all, let's set our game folder. I mean let's add our game path and to do that come here which says manage game folders just come here like this which says manage game folders and then press it here you see this plus icon over here just press on it and then locate listen and then locate the folder that contains your switch games so in this manner the games or my game is located inside user folder and then inside the rom folder roms to folder so here this is where my game is located here i'll just press on allow press on this thing over here use this folder and then press on allow 
and here press on i mean tick on scan and um, deep scan tick on this box which says deep scan tick on this and then press ok so um we are done adding our game path or our game folder so let's go back here and let's quit the app and relaunch the app again Okay, here it says firmware and retail games cannot be decrypted. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what this means is that after adding our game folder, um, it has dictated that, um, I mean, the game is not showing because we haven't set up both the firmware and the product keys. So um, to do that, head over to your folder that contains your firmware head over to the folder that contains your firmware so here i have here with me my firmware and also my product keys so um i'm going to extract this firmware and this product keys um first of all let's install the product keys first and to install the product keys just press on it and then select this one which is extract to so let's extract the product keys Okay, so um, this is the product keys. We've, we've extracted the product keys. Now come back to the emulator session like this. Go back to the session. Go back to the settings. Go back to this one. The settings. And then head over to this one, which is open Citron folder. Head over to this one, which says open Citron folder. And then um, open with your file manager. You should see something like this. What you have to do is press on, press here, and then locate. Listen, locate your product keys. Remember, we extracted the product keys. So let's go back to the storage. Yuzu, we extracted the product key to this folder. So these are our product keys. Let's select all the product keys. Press which says copy to press this one which says copy to and then press on this you should see your citron data folder this is your citron data folder so you press on your citron data folder and then you open the keys folder like this and then you copy it to this part Okay, so we are done with the installation of the product keys. What's left next is to install our firmware. To do that, go back to your um, your Z archiver like this. So this time around, we are going to install the firmware. So we will need to extract the firmware. Press on it once, and then you select on the third one, which says extract to. so um we've done with the extraction of the firmware and when we open it this this is the firmware list so we are going to install the extracted firmware and to do that just go back to the um how do you call it just go back to your emulator go back to your emulator and then at the same time go to open citron folder which is this one open it with your file manager so at this stage just press on this thing here and then and then go to your internal storage locate the extracted firmware folder so this is the firmware that we extracted to so open the folder then you should see your firmware what you have to do is just press on this three dots here and then you press on select all and then you press on the three dots again and you press on copy to now here press here like this you should see your citron data you see you should see something like this just press on this thing over here and then this time around open your nand folder and then open system open contents open registered 
and paste in the firmware that you copied press on this to copy to that folder so we are done copying the firmware to the respected folder just close close the emulator and then relaunch it again like this this time around you should see your games appearing at this stage so um i think that's all for today's video if you really like this video please subscribe to my channel thank you